Welcome to Let's Talk Lupus. Mouth sores can be an unfortunate side effect to lupus. Dr. Levy of SickKids Hospital is here to discuss oral health complications and how to best manage your oral health in this month's edition of Let's Talk Lupus. Mouth sores or oral ulcers commonly occur in people who have lupus, but there are different types of mouth sores. The most common type of oral ulcer is the painless ulcer that occurs on the roof or the hard palate of the mouth. Most patients are unaware that they have these ulcers, and usually it's the healthcare team that points out the ulcer to the patient. When the patient uses their tongue and feels the top of their mouth, they may feel the ulcer, but again, they say that it's painless and they didn't really know it was there. They can see it in the mirror if they look, but it's really asymptomatic. So the best way to manage these ulcers is really to treat the active lupus. These kinds of ulcers commonly occur at the same time as other lupus symptoms which might include rash on the face, or hair loss, or really any other lupus symptom. So when we treat the lupus, the underlying disease, and the other symptoms, the ulcers do generally go away, resolve, and they don't come back unless there's another um, episode of active lupus. The second type of oral ulcer is the painful kind. These can be smaller, and they can occur anywhere in the mouth, as well as on the lips. These ulcers, as I've said, are painful, and what's really important is that we make sure that there's no infection that's causing these ulcers. If the doctor or the healthcare team is able to rule out any kind of infection causing these ulcers, then they can be treated with topical steroids or with um, mouthwash that sometimes has some anesthetic in it, like lidocaine, to help with the pain, since these ulcers are painful or sometimes even oral prednisone is required in order to clear up these ulcers. If you experience these ulcers, it's also really important that you take good care of your oral health or your oral hygiene by regular toothbrushing as well as flossing in order to help the ulcers heal faster.